Good afternoon ladies and gentlemen, thank you for buying this package, I hope you'll get some use out of it. I thought I would uh, just include some uh, videos in this to help you through the process, for those of you that uh, haven't done much in the way of modelling. Uh, for those of you that have done a lot of modelling then you'll probably ignore these entirely. Anyway, the first thing I need to do here is just import my Victoria. So I have a scene open, I'm going to go File, Open Scene, select my Victoria which I've got saved off here and then wait a few moments for it to load into the scene. It only takes a few moments but it's a boring video while this happens. But, ah, there we are. So Victoria is imported and as you can see uh, she seems to have lots of blue lines around her. This is because she's been imported with all of her groups preserved. The groups are essentially separate parts of meshes. I don't want this uh, to be that way, I want it to have uh, one mesh to use otherwise I, I end up moving things around and it all goes wrong. So first of all then, if you hit Control A, right click on the mesh and then combine objects and now she'll become one whole object. So secondly then, we need to uh, import something on top of her to, to work or as I'll show in a later video, uh, I'll show you how to start uh, doing a box model to make your own meshes. So first of all then, I'm going to go File, Load into Scene and I'm going to select my low poly dress mo uh, mesh to, to get us going. So there we go, that's in there. It looks to have a little bit of poke through at the moment. Uh, depending on the distance you are from the model will depend on how much it uh, appears there is poke through. Uh, but with a, such a low poly mesh you're going to get a little bit uh, but these are things that we'll sort out as we go on. So that's the first video, just import it in, get the scene ready. The next video we'll go on to uh, just changing the shape a little bit to, to get the design we want uh, and we'll go from there. So I'll, I'll see you in the next video.